put just a light press to it. You hear that? Is that what you're having for supper? This is gonna be my signature sandwich at the diner. You know what I'm gonna call it? Bologna sandwich? That's a terrible name, no. I'm gonna name it the Boss Hog. You're gonna name it after yourself? Of course I am, because I'm inventing it. This has never been done before. A bologna sandwich? Dang it. I'm excited to say that I almost have the Boss Hog perfected. Yay! Burnt the end of the fingers. Once I'm finished, the recipe is gonna become a Robertson heirloom, like Phil's gumbo, Miss K's sweet potato pie. Why didn't you order food? I told you I was cooking bologna. That's why I ordered food. You know what they say, bologna lasts forever. A little boss hog. Dang it. What'd you say this was made out of? Hog. I'm not seeing hog. I see made with chicken, pork, and beef. Mechanically separated chicken. But it's the, the hog. The... Why don't you call it boss mechanically separated chicken? The hog or the pork. Or you could call it boss proponent potassium chloride. John Lee, get off that crap. I don't know what exactly they put into bologna, but to be honest, I don't care. You could call it boss water. When you buy stuff at a store, never read what's in it. If it tastes good, Nah. Who cares about a little exo mono potassium skeletor mm -mm -mm stuff anyway? If you try this, you're gonna like it. That sandwich is not gonna go into my mouth. When I eat a slab of bologna, I don't taste the ingredients. The only thing I taste is America. So I know you're wondering why I got you here at the restaurant. We are on the verge of, I believe, greatness. What this is called is the boss hog. You named this after yourself. When I started creating this sandwich, uh, I didn't know exactly what I was going to do, but I know I wanted to go back to my roots. So I wanted it to be about Americana. Sorry. I wanted to say something Willie. about our society. We've got to go get the kids in a minute. Okay. I mean, can we see all this? All right, all right. So you ready for the big reveal? Yes. Ah, don't drink that. OK, so despite being the culinary achievement of the year, the boss hog still hasn't generated quite the excitement that I wanted to. Without further ado, ladies, your masterpiece. So I brought in some of my more refined, palated friends who are clearly doing everything they can to contain their excitement. The boss hog. Mmm, the sandwich of the... Well, this is disappointing. I can't do it. You don't like bologna? If Wait. we would have known it was a bologna, I, don't, I mean, I wouldn't have even come. Why didn't you just have the guys do the taste I test? need a sophisticated taste. I'm not sure if sophisticated palates like bologna. That's exactly right. Mmm. It's good. What? I, you like I that? promise you should try it. It's delicious. It's got buttered toast. Like you love cheese. Like buttered toast. Candied jalapenos. The bologna. Here we go. Here it's we, so good. Here we go. Well, it's good. It's good. It's delicious. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> well, there you have it. The people have spoken, and the boss hog is a hit. It's so good. This is all the confirmation I need to include the boss hog on the menu. I told y'all it was good. Not only will my sandwich be the best seller at Willie's Duck Diner, but it will become an American staple, alongside the po' boy, the Philly cheesesteak, and the Reuben sandwich. But I should probably get this thing trademarked. I bet old Reuben's kicking himself right now for not trademarking that guy. Missy, just go ahead and take a bite of it. Two out of three people say bologna is right for them. One does not. Uh, technically, two out of two people like it, because you didn't even try it. So but, I'm actually going to dismiss you from this taste test, so you're just, something's <laughs> wrong with you. Because there's so many things in that meat, if you don't like the smell oh, of all gosh. that, then you got a problem with a bunch of stuff. Beef, let's not talk chicken, about what okay. Okay. pork, okay. Look, Willie, Willie. sodium chloride, all those, all those... All right, let's not talk about what's in it. celery seed, okay. paprika. Thank you, I'm out of here.